Hello friends, good evening. It is 7 p.m. Uh, today I was at the If Gathering Women's Conference at the church much longer than I thought. Uh, originally planned for 10 to 4, ended up being like 9 to 6, which is great. It was a great day. It just left me very little time to do what I need to get done now that I'm home. Um, got home, kids were playing outside. They spent a few hours out there today, which is wonderful. It was like in the 70s, like 72, 74 degrees out. And so they got to enjoy that for many hours. And then I'm still just decompressing. Just a lot of wonderful information. Um, I don't want to say thrown at us because that, that has a negative connotation to it, but just presented to us. Wonderful live worship music and great friends, and it was a great day. And I'm home now, and I get to see my family. Alice ran out to the van, and she's like, I haven't seen you all day. I was starting to forget what you looked like. She's a little bit of a drama queen. So it's nice that Will has tomorrow off, and... Um, but we have church tomorrow and then I have a tea party that I'm going to tomorrow at right after church so this was a very full weekend of wonderful things but just a lot and I'm finding that I'm not gonna have a whole lot of time to recharge I have got a salad as my dinner starter uh huh and then I've got some steak in the air fryer and that'll that'll be my dinner for tonight and probably I'll probably snack on some fruit later do you have plans for like? Do we have plans for tonight? What's what does today look like for you? <sighs> Nothing in particular. I mean, probably be the only chance we have to like, watch a movie or something if we wanted to, or we could. I spent all day yesterday watching movies. Tackle Hunt a Killer if you want. I don't think I have. I'm not in the mental headspace for that today. I am like, you know, like when you get. I mean, if you've ever been to any sort of like conference or training or anything of like great material, and your brain has just been on all day, and now I need to mush as is my body like I felt fine like we were leaving the church and like some of my friends were like I am so tired and I was like I am great this is great I, I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna do all the things and then I got in the car and like the 30 minute drive home and then I got home and it, things just keep getting slower and slower for me <laughs> so I think just decompressing and spending a quiet evening maybe watching a movie or something sure He's easy we'll like that. What? what? So we'll have to figure out what we're watching. That's what I meant. Like what? We'll have I, to figure out what movie. You know. Yeah, I don't know. We'll figure that out. Uh, what else do you guys do? What was your favorite part of today, Alice? Playing outside. Playing outside. Jackson, what was your favorite part? I didn't hear you. Friends. Playing outside. See? That's really all I did today. Yeah? I'm glad. Um... I have to edit a video so, so when I said like it didn't give me much time I had planned on being home like probably like on the early end of things like 4 30 but then I considered or I took into consideration like we'd probably be chatting a little bit saying goodbyes and stuff at the church so five but like the material didn't even end until 5 30 quarter six I don't know things were just running slightly behind which is fine um, but it just again left me a little time. I still have to edit a video that needs to be posted today as of like when I'm recording this So today is currently Saturday. I do not have Saturday's video up yet I have been vlogging daily or posting some sort of material daily since I think January 5th of 2022 so I'm on a really great streak and I don't want to um, break that if I don't have to in fact I was just telling well when I went to go make my salad I was like I don't think I'm gonna even vlog today like I just don't have it in me and then I made my salad and walked back out to the living room by the time I sat down I was like I'm gonna pick up the camera so changed my mind real quick um, so my consistency has been great I have noticed I'm not sure what it is and typically I wouldn't even mention this but I just kind of find it kind of funny my I'm I've got my subscribers have dropped a bit uh, and I don't know if it's because I'm being more more authentic in um, like my spirituality and faith. I kind of talked to Will about this. So I mean, I guess the ones that are leaving, it's fine. And I'm just more appreciative of those of you that have stuck around and stay stay stuck around. 
it's just, um, you know, social media is weird, basically. All right, for all the people in the comments, I want to know this. Do you guys ever unsubscribe from anything? I don't, like hardly ever. If stuff comes up in my feed that I don't want to see, I just scroll past it. And Tiffany says that she unsubscribes from stuff, so I'm just wondering, cause, you know, like she said, we talked about the loss of subscribers thing, and I'm more inclined to think it's you know just YouTube YouTubing. Yeah, because YouTube does go through and does like a clean out every once in a while, and that could be what's happening. There's really no way to know for sure. And yes, I do unsubscribe from things. Because there are seasons of life where I'll subscribe to certain things. Um, you know, I was subscribed to like Weight Watchers channels when I was doing right. Weight Watchers and I'll unsubscribe. I mean, so yes, I unsubscribe from things. And my I channel- I other people do. Cause I mean, I don't know, maybe people are e-hoarders like I am. And just... You are like, <laughs> yeah, don't look at his email inbox because it gives me anxiety. He, yeah. Whereas my inbox, like, very clean, very clean. I hate having anything in my inbox, but there are certain things in there that are flagged that I can easily access at any time. Anyway, all that, all that to say, I, I don't know, like social media is weird. Um, YouTube's weird, but be. we're here and I'm here to tell my story. And I just had a wonderful, wonderful weekend with uh, the Lord and my friends. <laughs> my friend God. We hung out this weekend. I took a lot of notes. I need to sort through that. There was a lot. I know, I'm <laughs> such a nerd. They even gave me a new notebook to write my notes in. Um, so it just opened my eyes to a lot of things and like a, a reigning like theme through the weekend was like just truth and the difference between our truth and God's truth and like society's truth and God's truth. The guy from Too Hot to Handle? No. No. <laughs> um, you're a mess. <laughs> uh, I can't, my brain's mush. I'm gonna stop talking because I just keep saying, uh, I'm gonna eat my salad and wait for my steak to be done and hang out with my husband because I feel like I haven't seen him. Even though we spent three hours at the Batman yesterday, I feel like I haven't seen him in like a week. Vengeance. I haven't even seen the clip that you recorded yet. Oh. I will be editing that soon if I ever get around to doing that. It is. It's nothing special. Um, great. <laughs> Quality content like that. Why? Why would people not want to stay? Well, that's why I'm often not in. I'm usually just there to. Apply a little bit of laughter and then I go away. <laughs> Lest I scare people off. That he do. Because the whole talking into the camera thing is harder than it looks. It's not. It is. It's not. We are now sitting at 9 o'clock and I'm having some oranges and watching Castle on Hulu because that's how I roll. And Will is napping on and off next to me in, in the recliner because life is tiring. I think I'm actually gonna close this out. I was able to kind of recap today. I don't wanna be like stressing about getting more footage when it's this late in the evening. Um, so yeah, just a great, wonderful, filled, wonderful filled, wonderfully filled weekend thus far. And we still have tomorrow with church and a tea party. So thank you for coming along today. Drop a comment, share some love, and until next time, we will see you later. Bye.